Here it is. It's the beginning of January. Are you looking for a good holiday gift? I have one for you. I've got this beautiful 2019 Tahoe. She's a 2150. Very low hours. Top condition. So make your holidays and get ready for the upcoming summer because you know it's coming with this 2019 Tahoe here at South Mountain Yachts. We're going to do a full walk around tour. So stay tuned and enjoy the day. Here we are starting off forward starboard bow on this 2150 Tahoe. She's a 2019 on a 2021 trailer. If you notice the trailer, we have a nice swing away tongue on there. We also have a spare tire with a spare tire carrier right there. And down along the sides, we can see the diamond step plate. Here at the bow of the boat, we have LED port and starboard lights. Our, our boarding ladder is right here. Notice the flat deck. This is actually designed to, so you can beach the boat, come out here. We also have a 12 volt outlet there. If you want, you can get a trolling motor. It's already set up and wired for it. Put it in there, use this as a casting platform. Tahoe does a really nice job. Notice we have pop-up cleats, forward facing horn. Coming down along the side, we see she's just been buffed and waxed, ready for the season. There's our badge, Tahoe. Tires, the whole trailer probably has less than 10 miles on it. It hasn't been splashed yet. Here we are at the transom. We see our depth sounder right there. Boarding ladder. And then our Merc Cruiser, our Mercury engine right here. 200 horsepower. She's a four stroke fuel injection. 200 horsepower along with the stainless steel prop. Coming down along the side, we see we've got some nice color graphics. And there we are. She's a beaut. From here, let's go aboard. Here we are boarding the vessel. On the starboard side, we see immediately in front of us, under that hatch is battery access, and notice that's actually lockable. We've got our pop-up cleats. This was an option and an upgrade. We've got our ski toe pylon right there. This gives us an overview of the cockpit. We enter the vessel through this transom door here. And notice how the seat actually lifts up right there so nobody's walking all over your vinyl seats. This gives us a nice view forward. Notice the heavy duty hardware right here. Down along both gunnels, we see we have rod holding, rod holders right there. And the length is actually marked so you know what you can put in there. Here at the helm we have our side-by-side -side companion seat with the flip-up thigh-rise bolsters. Now should you desire this piece here is actually removable for a sleeker aft deck look right here. We've got seating all the way across the transom and cooler storage up underneath. It's nice to have dedicated space. Here at the helm, we see we have our powder-coated grab rail all around, our mercury shift throttle, ignition switch, very important, our Bluetooth stereo, USB ports, Garmin chart plotter, and fish finder, and then this is our Mercury Smart Craft system right there. It shows engine hours, tilt, fuel consumption, about 18 different factors it'll show. We have a 
stainless steel ship's wheel here. And of course we have the suicide knob right there. Nice little windshield to kind of break up the wind flow. Now there is a bimini, as I mentioned earlier, we do have it down. And there's also a full storage cover on the boat. You can tow with it also. As we move forward, we see we've got storage here, which is lined and insulated. Here in the foredeck, we have an in-deck hatch, great place for skis and other toys. Now this area, you can have a filler board added, so this area can become a very large sun pad right here. We've got console storage, and then there's the table, which we saw set up earlier. Up under these seats, we have the insulated fish boxes. And then here at the bow, notice the seat folds back. Again, we're not stepping and walking on it. Up, there's our hatch for our boarding ladder. Circling back around, this gives us an overview on this Tahoe 2150. She's neat, clean, very low hours, ready to go for the next owner. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.